Have you ever wondered how the world's 17th largest desert, the Thar Desert, came into existence? The story of the Thar Desert's formation is as fascinating as the desert itself. It began around 4,000 to 10,000 years ago. Imagine, if you will, the Earth's crust shifting, creating a rift in the landscape. This rift, known as the Aravalli Range, created a natural barrier, causing the region to dry up and form a desert. The climatic changes also played a significant role. Over the millennia, the region's climate transitioned from a humid subtropical one to an arid climate, furthering the desertification process. It wasn't a sudden shift, but a gradual transformation that took thousands of years, a testament to nature's slow yet relentless force. And so the Thar Desert, a vast expanse of sand, was thus formed, etching a permanent mark on the face of the Earth. This desert, a mirage of sand, continues to evolve, shaped by the hands of time and the whims of the weather. Imagine living in a place where rain is a rare event and sandstorms are a part of daily life. Welcome to the Thar Desert, a place where life thrives against the odds, a testament to the resilience of nature and the tenacity of humanity. The Thar Desert, a vast expanse of arid land, is home to an astonishing variety of flora and fauna, each uniquely adapted to withstand the harsh desert conditions. The flora here is predominantly thorny bushes, cacti, and grasses, all of which have developed unique mechanisms to survive with minimal water. For instance, the roots of these plants run extraordinarily deep, reaching down to the water table, while their leaves are small to limit water loss through evaporation. Similarly, the fauna of the Thar has evolved to live in harmony with the desert. The Indian gazelle, or chinkara, has adapted to obtain all the water it needs from the plants it eats, rarely needing to drink. The great Indian bustard, a bird native to this region, has a lighter color to reflect the sun's rays and keep cool. Even the insects, like the darkling beetles, have evolved to condense the moisture in the air onto their bodies and then drink it. But it's not just the flora and fauna that have learned to adapt. The human inhabitants of the Thar, the nomadic tribes, have developed a lifestyle that is in perfect harmony with the desert environment. Their diet consists mainly of locally available plants, dairy products, and occasionally, meat. Their traditional clothing, often brightly colored, serves a dual purpose. It reflects the harsh sunlight, keeping them cool, and the vibrant colors make them easily visible in the vast, monotonous landscape. Their homes, known as jumpas, are low, round huts made of mud and grass, designed to stay cool in the day and, and warm during the chilly desert nights. Water, a precious commodity, is often stored in earthen pots to keep it cool. Life in the Thar is not for the faint-hearted, it's a testament to the resilience of nature and humanity. The Thar Desert, a seemingly inhospitable land, is teeming with life, each entity uniquely adapted to not just survive but to thrive. Did you know that the Thar Desert is under serious threat? Yes, this vibrant, resilient ecosystem is facing numerous challenges that endanger its very existence. One of the most pressing issues is climate change. Rising global temperatures have led to erratic weather patterns, causing unpredictable periods of drought and intense heat waves. The desert, already a harsh environment, has seen its conditions become even more extreme. The unique flora and fauna, adapted to the desert's usual climate, struggle to survive under these new, harsher conditions. Then, there's the issue of desertification. You might be thinking, isn't the Thar already a desert? Well, yes, but desertification is different. It refers to the degradation of land, a transformation from fertile to barren. In the case of the Thar, areas on its periphery, once productive and rich with vegetation, are being transformed into barren landscapes. This change not only threatens the local wildlife, but also the communities who rely on these lands for their livelihoods. Human activities, too, play a significant role in the deterioration of this ecosystem. Take mining, for example. The Thar is rich in minerals like gypsum, phosphorite, and kaolin, making it a hotspot for mining activities. But these operations, while economically beneficial, often leave behind a scarred and degraded landscape. Overgrazing is another issue. The desert is home to numerous pastoral communities whose livestock feed on the sparse vegetation. But excessive grazing can lead to soil erosion and degradation, further exacerbating the desertification process. The future of the Thar Desert hangs in a delicate balance, its survival dependent on our actions. 
We must strive to mitigate the effects of climate change, manage our resources responsibly, and protect this unique ecosystem. After all, the Thar is more than just a vast expanse of sand. It's a living, breathing entity, home to countless species and cultures. And it's up to us to ensure that it remains so for generations to come. Beyond the harsh conditions and environmental challenges, the Thar Desert is a treasure trove of rich cultural heritage. Amidst the arid landscapes, a vibrant culture thrives, shaped by the enduring spirit of the people who call this desert home. Their music, a symphony of soulful tunes and rhythmic beats, echoes across the dunes, weaving stories of their courage and resilience. Their dances, a riot of colors and fluid movements, celebrate life in its myriad forms. The Thar is also a canvas for their unique art and handicrafts. Intricate embroidery, mirror work, and pottery are more than just expressions of creativity. They are the threads that hold together the fabric of their community, passed down through generations. Every festival here is a testament to their unity, their joyous spirit, undeterred by the harsh desert. The Thar Desert, a seemingly desolate expanse of sand, is in fact brimming with life and cultural richness. In the past few minutes, we have traversed the sands of time, exploring the mysteries of the Thar Desert. We've uncovered its ancient origins, revealing a seemingly barren landscape that is in fact teeming with unique life forms, each one adapted to the harsh and arid conditions. We've delved into the challenges this ecosystem faces, from climate change to human encroachment, issues that threaten the delicate balance of life in the desert. And yet, amidst these vast stretches of sand, we found a vibrant cultural heritage, a testament to the resilience of human spirit. The tales of valor, songs of longing, and dances of celebration, all echoing through the golden dunes, painting a picture of life that is as rich as it is diverse. The Thar Desert is a testament to the indomitable spirit of life, surviving and thriving amidst the sands. Thank you for watching, and please subscribe for more fascinating journeys into the world around us.